Hey, happy homebrew Wednesday, everybody. Uh, got my Sony Bloggy the other day, and that's what I'm recording on now. So I thought, since I have mobility for the first time uh, without having to lug around a big laptop, I would take you around my house a little bit and uh, show you a couple of the, the things that I got, uh, like my brew closet and other little projects going on. Uh, say hello to Leo. Hello, Leo. And we have a uh, baby bird over here, a little cockatiel. He talks a little bit, but you kind of have to prompt him. So I'm just going to probably go into some low light situations where you're not going to be able to see me all that well for a second. But uh, just uh, hold on for a minute and everything should be a little better. All right, so this is my brew closet. Up on the top shelf, I have most of my glassware, uh, glass carboy, flasks, uh, beakers, things like that. And then I have a couple of things hanging over here, just some hose, bottle brushes. Down here, got a couple of pots, my burner, uh, the wart chiller. And if you look in here, I got some better bottles. And then on the other side, there's a little mini door. Got my, I know this lighting isn't the best in here, but I got my mash tun there. Uh, more better bottles, more buckets. Back there, well, you're not going to be able to see that, but back there, I have my um, empty bottles. So, that's the closet. A lot of stuff's missing right now, actually, because my brother, I left a lot of my stuff in my brother's house, because that's where we're going to brew the graph. So I left a lot of the ingredient stuff there, and um, we, uh, we were going to brew probably this weekend. That ghoulish graph never got done uh, this past weekend, mainly because I forgot the, <laughs> forgot the grains, the right grains anyway. I took uh, the wrong grains with me, so that kind of sucked. And um, we decided to just let it go for another week and do it then. I'm, I don't know if you could tell, I'm kind of sick. I got sick over the weekend and I'm trying to nurse this cold a little bit, which is why I'm not drinking, well, I'm drinking homebrew of a sense. I'm drinking homebrewed coffee. So Over here I got my uh, kombucha. I haven't been doing this really. And I've left it for so long that the SCOBY has sort of become enormous. <laughs> I mean, look at that monster of a SCOBY in there. That guy is just killer. Um, it's taking up half of the container right now. And um, the kombucha that's in there is vinegar at this point. So uh, it's not something I would drink anymore. Um, I really have to do something with this. I've kind of... I kind of lost interest in it for a little while. Look at that. Ugh. It looks disgusting, but <laughs> it tastes pretty good when you let it go. Um, yeah, so that is um, that is probably... I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Uh, I'm thinking of maybe brewing some new stuff, throwing most of that scoby out and like starting afresh or maybe just not doing it at all I really don't know oh look at this see if you can see if we can get a good look at this I believe that the Clemens package might have arrived it's the UPS truck out there so I, uh, I think I was waiting on the, uh, the Clements to send their box of beer, so I think we actually got kind of lucky here. And uh, it seems as though UPS has just arrived with something. Uh, might be something else, but you never know. Could have gotten lucky. Yep, package for me. Happy days. So we got something here. Um, I don't want to get too close on the address, but... Uh, gonna open that box see what we got 
If I wasn't so lazy, I would go get the tripod for this thing, but I am pretty lazy, so I'm going to try to do this one-handed, and hopefully uh, everything will be okay. So here's a box, and this is from the Clements. Um, they packaged this real nice. Let's see what we got. Oh, awesome. Firestone DBA Double Barrel Ale. Very cool. Firestone Walker. Very cool. Never had that one, so I'm looking forward to that. I was looking forward to all these. Let's see what else we got. This is... Let's see. Now, there's a little sticker on the cap that might be something with a note in there. Um, oh, you know what I think this must be? is They said they were going to throw in a... Um, a homebrew. I forget what homebrew they said it was. I have to double check the message. That must be the homebrew. That's in a nice giant bomber bottle. Very cool. I gotta double check to see what that is. But 514. I guess maybe that's the day that it was bottled. Just having some more coffee. Alright, let's see. I'm glad that this was packaged in such a way that I can kind of snag it out without having to, uh, without having to uh, use two hands. Firestone Union Jack. All right, cool. The India Pale Ale. This was I, th I think that's the one that I f originally said to them on one of their reviews. I said that it looked really good, but um, I can't get it around me. So that's kind of what prompted them to want to send some beers, um, and especially the Firestone. I knew they were going to be sending a bunch of Firestone for me. All right, let's see. Looks like there's a whole nother layer. Holy cow. Wow. You guys are great, man. Let's see. Another Firestone. This one is the Double Jack. Double IPA. Now that I think of it, I wonder, was it the Double Jack or the... No, I think it was the Union Jack that was commenting on the... <laughs> you guys hear that? Those are the acorns coming down. Acorn! Acorns are hitting me on the head. Very cool. Let's see what else. Uh oh. I think I see. Yep. You guys, I gotta send you some real cool stuff now. I'm making sure to, to get some uh, really good beers for you because look what they look what they sent me. Oh, I can't believe it. Pliny the Elder. I've been wanting to try that for a long time. Everyone's always talking about it. And I have never tried it before. I can't get it around here. Awesome. Thank you so much. That's going to enjoy the hell out of that. And it looks like another bomber bottle. Something big. Whoop. Oh, Wookie Jack. I was just looking at this one, the Black Rye IPA. Sweet. Very cool, guys. Wow, you sent me a whole load of stuff. Let's see. There's the whole, the whole gang together there. Three bombers, three uh, 12 ounces. Bunch of Firestone, Double Jack, Wookie Jack. DBA and Union Jack, plus the Pliny and the Homebrew, which I have to uh, double check what that was again that you sent me. So cool, man. Thank you very much. I um, have a few things already for you, and I'm going to take a look at that list you sent me and send a couple more things, make sure that I get uh, a good package together like you had for me. And I will reuse this packaging, obviously, because... This is going to make it a lot easier. <laughs> um, all right. I'll cut it off there because I'm, uh, I'm going to need to take some medicine now. Uh, Clements, Kevin Christian, thank you so very much. That's a great package of beer. I can't wait to try this stuff. Um, real, I feel spoiled now. I'll, uh, I'll have a package out for you very soon. Uh, I hope you enjoy the stuff I send you. Everybody else, happy Homebrew Wednesday, and I'll see you soon. Bye.